Oh man, just when you want to go fishing, it starts to rain. We're still going fishing. You're going with me. In sickness. Here we go. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies. Check it out. Decals for sickness now. Not that anybody else would want one, but I got them. I got them completely. Got it, look at it. carpet decal. Bam! Sickness, it is a sickness for crappie fishing. It's raining! It's raining. Dang it. Let's see if we can't catch some fish real quick. Before we get started, here, while we motor, while we motor, I'm gonna show you guys some stuff. Before, in an episode, a couple episodes ago, I shared with you the Let's Go Fishing Pack. And in that episode, I accidentally said 50 jigs. You don't get 50 jigs, you get 80 jigs. 80 jigs and about 12 plastics. And this thing comes in its own packet. It's ready to rock and roll. It has every color three pound fishing has, except for the chartreuse 116, just because we needed space in the deal. Uh, but you get 80 jigs, it's a heck of a deal. You need to check that out at threepoundfishing.com. I carry this thing, you can use it however you want, but I've got this guy loaded down with all my jigs. And it is so convenient when we are on guide trips and just fishing, because I've got it all right there. So I recommend it to you, check it out. Um, outside of that, next event for three pound fishing is gonna be over at Truman. Then we got the national championships. So we're just gonna idle to a spot, fish some structure. We've got nice, cool temperatures. A big storm's rolling this way. But actually, temperature-wise right now, it's pretty pleasant. Water temperature's around 78 degrees. So it's definitely warming up and it is changing. Those fish are starting to get a little finickier. Not as crazy, but uh, guide trips are being awesome. So I'm gonna take you along for the ride today. We're gonna throw that new paddle tail. Let me see that new paddle tail. There's a lot of talking going on, I know, but we're just trolling to our spot right now. I'm trying to cl stay close to the house. That's the new paddle tail. That's the monkey milk one right there. And uh, I love it. The June bug for you June bug guys. Right there, super soft plastic, a lot of action, a lot of action. Get those at the website as well. Fun. Right there. Catching them like it's no problem right now. It's really easy fishing right now, it seems like. This is evening, maybe before the storm is the reason why, but we had to work at them a little bit during the guy trip today. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. The thunder is coming. There's another one right there. Now check this fish out, folks. This is pretty cool. So look at all the wore out spots, sores. Those will go away. I've noticed it last year. And then you can see them when, they, when you when you catch them again, you sometimes not the same fish, obviously, but another fish. You'll see where they had those, and they kind of wore out. Um, but you see the once you guys you see that right there. There's one on its tail. There's one on this side here. But isn't that interesting? If you know anything more about it, let me know. But my impression is it does go away. And it was the same exact same thing with the uh, right after the spawn last year. Incredible experience. It's always a good experience with Garmin. It's very interesting. But I couldn't see my jig. I couldn't see anything. It was horrible. And this was not because of that update. I had put the brand new update and everybody was bragging about it. And uh, I was like, man, this is still horrible. And so I called Garmin up and uh, the guy said, switch it back to factory defaults. And I was like, really? Come on, that's like, you know, is that just what, what play is that in your handbook, you know? And I did it. And I'm not kidding you. Those are my settings now. The defaults that Garmin get, comes with, the unit comes with is my settings. I have not changed it at all. So I'm at medium 
uh, noise reject them. I think the TVG is off completely. Um, I have completely gone to the defaults on my Garmin. And so now when people get my boat, they go, how do you get your picture so clear? And I go, nothing. It's literally the defaults, which is ridiculous. But we're gonna move up here and try a different spot. But I thought that was an interesting thing. And so now I don't tell anybody there's any secrets to what, I'm, what kind of settings I have. So I think, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to dabble with some different colors now. We'll see how this June bug goes right here. spot quick fish this is gonna end it though for us because this storm is coming down on us right there I appreciate you guys watching I do enjoy your summer thanks for watching three pound fishing partnered up with these fantastic companies